God wants us to be fair and kind and he doesn't want us to take advantage of people and it's important in your spiritual walk to find out if if you did in the past or maybe you're doing it now do you know while you spiritually grow especially if you're doing these videos with me teaching videos or working in my come near to god published workbook you will find that taking advantage of people is not what God wants us to do. And to find that in your life, which it can hinder. Because if you're taking advantage of someone, it can bring in sins of selfishness, self-centeredness, entitlement, um, pride, vanity, self-righteousness, ego, lying, gossiping, slander, malice, backbiting. What else, Coop? competition, strife, division, coveting, stealing, self-entitlement, you gotta watch out for that, wanting credentials all the time, uh, hijacking people's ministries. I have had people trying to hijack my copyright material, which, you know, that could be a court case if I wanted. It, it just goes on and on, and you don't want that in your spiritual walk you want to be close to god and jesus right that's why i'm here i'm here to help you to teach you taking advantage of people is not godly at all these people they took advantage of my horse and they took advantage of my property that's why i'm always chainsawing and i disappear because i'm in the brush with the rattlesnakes there's one right over there a few weeks ago i spotted him i didn't slip on him this time i didn't step on him God's helping me. God helps you. Are you taking advantage of people? People need to stop taking advantage because when they take advantage of you, you need to step back, soldier. You need to step back. When God says they're taking advantage of you, you need to step back and I will work with them and I'll send other people. You listen to him, okay? It's very important. And if you're taking advantage of someone, you need to work on that, okay? Ask God, am I taking advantage of anybody? 